Ah, yes, boys. Tokyo Shimmer to Drift 2. Let's get back into it, see what we can do here. I just want the nighttime. I don't know, really, what's left, honestly. I don't... I think it said there's two or three other courses after this as well. I just... I don't know, but we're gonna keep rolling. So we got that team and we got the high gambler. So the high gambler first. I don't remember what the team was called. Who we got? Greatest line. It's a freaking gallant. Most people focused on engine and suspension. More racers to pay attention to the body. He makes a living producing sheet metal for cars. Customers who don't take good care of their cars' bodies often get yelled at. He treats his own car's body like a treasure and agonizes over even little dings like they were major tragedies. As you might guess, he never goes out on dirt roads. What do we have? What are we driving? Where are we? Oh, we got to He never goes out on dirt roads, yet he's racing on a course that's all gravel. Stupid. Stupid. He's a stupid man. Let's go. Let's do it, man. Let's do it, man. Let's do it. We ready? I just how like the headlights don't work. I don't know if it's just like that. It's gotta be just the emulator, but like my headlights are no bueno. Excuse me, sir. I would like to squeeze by. Bop. <laughs> Oops. Is it just a distance battle? Got it. Car, come on. I oh, caught him. He caught him. He caught him. That's not good. It's not good. We're right here. Hey, Easy, yeah? Easy. We do boo. Alright, let's take down his team. Uh Blades Spirits. Team leader. <laughs> the Blade Spirits are finally coming together as one of the all-time greats. The leader of the Blade Spirits and Impreza only team. This doesn't mean, however, that they're a rally-oriented team. It's just that they enjoy highway-only races. Those other upstart Impreza drivers can't hope to compete with Suda's skill. Okay. I'm still a newbie in the Blade Spirits, but I'm an, une I'm an even match for our leader, Suda. He's like, yeah, I can be leader. You a bitch. Akiyoshi didn't know too many other people driving Prezas and decided to look for some. He came across an article about the Blade Spirits in a magazine and immediately applied to join the team. His skills are, of course, considerable. Otherwise, he wouldn't have made the team. His technique is on par with Sudis. All right, what's the last dude? Whether it's the GC8 or the GDB, if it says Subaru on it, you know it's got to be fast. One of the founders of the Pleiad Spirits team leader Suda has already switched to a GDB, but Ketsu still clings to his GC8. He's built it into a fine machine over the years, and he and his GC can hold their own against any component, even a GDB or a Lancer. I mean, honestly, GC8, it's, it's just, come on. This is my favorite, though. So, yeah. All three, let's go. Crank them out. Easy. Against my Evo. Ready? A uh, tail slide dash. Bop. Bop. Yep. Banging the gears, yeah? Yep. Wham, 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 wham. This is like you can play with a wheel, right? Could you imagine playing this game with a wheel? How difficult that must be? Oh, boy. Those old PS2 wheels, man. You probably break it before you get 10% done the game. Oh, we're just banging a rev limer. Yep, well. Oh, we got him. We got him. He's out of here. See ya. Wave power on. Wave power. And what does that mean? We switch from petrol, gasolina, ultimate gasolina, to freaking uh, water, boys. Got it from the aliens. I got abducted one night. And they were like, hey, boy. And your, and your machine down there. You don't have anti-gravity. I will give you power of water, yes. I don't know if aliens have that kind of an accent, but you know, now they do. We watch a lot of alien stuff lately, man. It's, it's crazy. The Y files on YouTube, it's, it's kind of crazy. A lot of conspiracy theories and like, oh boy. It's 
fun. It's good times, you know? It's gonna end on it. Oh, he's done. He's done. He's done. Six gear gone. Cut off demon. Was that his name? Oh, scary. Who's next? Who's next? A team steward. Let's go. What a great Subi. My favorite one right there. Was it 04? Good one. GCA is pretty damn good as well. I don't know. That's a tough. That's a tough one. Yeah, boy. Oh, we're ripping. We're ripping. Oh, he's done. He's done. See ya. Can't hang, man. Get him out of here. Uh, one guy? Who that? Skyline Turbo RSX. Excuse me. That's a that's an Evo. Lancers all the way. The CE9A is a little outdated, but it can hold its own against newer models. Fukunaga asked himself, what's the greatest car on the roads? He found his answer in his current car, the CE9A Lancer. There's no denying that the car's mechanics are old, but with Fukunaga's excellent driving technique and performance as well as an Evo 7 or 8. Ha! About to find out. Oh. Oh, that's why. We can win that? Ha! Hell yeah, dude. Put it on the line. Huh? Do it. Doom, 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 doom. Just got a clear time. Gonna race his ghost. See you, bud. Bop. You know. Are we gonna get him here just like we got all the others? Oh, we can't because it's freaking a timed. Yeah, that that was not as OK. We we done goofed. Their gear's fine. Oh, he's nowhere near us. Why well, when I hit the brakes, it goes left. What do? It doesn't like slide like I want it to. It just Probably tracks control, honestly. <laughs> See, <you>, bud. <laughs> Beams, give it up, boo, let's give it deep, boop, boop, bop, 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 gimme. Beep, boop, boop, boop. Ba doom, 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 doom. I guess we'll check out some of the other places. One. Trickster? Hello. Rotary Commander. I crash at the racing club. I crash at work. Why don't I just lie down and die already? Jesus Christ. Just when he thought he was finally getting over the trauma of the huge crash he once suffered at the first corner of a meet, now he's screwed up big time at work. He was entrusted with a very important project, but missed his deadline by a long shot. The experience has taken the edge out of his racing. Whoa, whoa, no, 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 no. And then, and then, and then, ride in this car. Go battle. Oh, I don't. Well, I guess we use automatic now. I hate that you can't just set it to manual and just leave it. You know, every race you gotta freaking be like, no. Uh, uh. Listen to that rotary. <laughs> R. What a difference that makes, yeah? Oh, we're automatic. Watch out. Excuse me, sir. Oh, we're gone. See ya.
I'm still shifting. <laughs> Can't stop me. Uh oh, good thing we got support tires on. See you, bud. <laughs> Two minutes flat. <laughs> We check Zao yet? Zao. Bang, bang. No. I'm not even gonna, honestly. We probably missed so much stuff in this game just cause. Six wins. One email, 14 beebs. Checking the email first, we learned a lesson. Sorry, but I had the message deleted from the server discussing it here may ruin the plan. Oh boy. Okay, all right. There's several types of muffler tuning now, low rev type, high rev type, etc. Anyway, I'll leave it up to you to pick your own tuning style. Yeah. I hate that series of loose corners right at the start. You know how they make your car jerk side to side? That really irks me. Dude's over here jerking it. What? There's more? Nope, I'm sure of it. A bunch of racers from Remote World got thrashed by him. At least he's not talking about ruling the road or some crap like those punks from Tokyo. Yeah, and he's getting challenges from a whole bunch of people. I'm putting my money on him. Cool. Oh, there's more here. Cool, cool. Thirteen Devils must know that Nico has been a pretty high level course for a long time. They sent some of their best racers here. I might never get over the trauma of that big crash in the first corner. I think I'll just lay low for a while. I got no sense of direction. All these forks in the road are killing me. I usually get lost before I can even finish the battle. But I'm a bona fide human being. Show me a little respect. The hell? I don't think any of the highway racing leader types here in Okado will give you the time of day unless you've got some kind of proof that you're good enough to battle them. Is this why that man asked us to come here? In any case, that guy's unbelievably fast. Are we done? No. No, there's more. Yep, my body's all dented up. Better haul it down to the repair shop. Sigh. Please screw up that battle yesterday. At this rate, they'll never let me into that rally team. Okay. You know that racer on stage two that's got everybody talking? I wonder if he'll show up here too. I guess we should check the day tracks. Like this one. Uh, nope. We've done a lot of races, man. Usui. <laughs> Ooh, ooh, ooh. Who that? Oh, it's a freaking sponsor. Oh, that's cool. Still 80. Damn. We could use a new sponsor. Get more money. By the time I went back, I think they like. That if you race them and you lose, I don't know. I ain't worried about it. Let's go nighttime. Boop, 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 boop. Back here, we're doing it. Anybody? I mean, we didn't get any like new requests or anything. Just two dudes, two regular old dudes, huh?
Uh, where are they at? A supporter? Killer kickback. My skin's so dry, I feel shriveled up like a mummy. People ask me, are you from a pyramid or what? Weird. He used to work as a programmer for an IT company. He wasn't very good at it, though, and he got transferred to another department. But he didn't fit in there either and ended up getting fired. Now he lives a rather bleak life, ecking, ecking out a meager living from his hobby of racing. Eking? Ecking? Eking? Who knows? Let's go, supporter. Yep. Yeah. We just gotta put distance on this fool. Easy. Actually, probably not easy. He's fast. That dude was on us the whole freaking time, man. Okay, alright. And this dude. Not, well, not this dude, but, you know. Pride of Nupuka. Not even the 13 Devils could follow us here. They'd have to get special Kato tuning first. <laughs> he once got so lost in a snowstorm that he almost died, and this wasn't in the mountains or some deserted area, but in the middle of town. His sense of direction is so bad that he even gets confused on courses where there's only one way to go. Seems he's not really cut out for driving in the first place. Whoa. Yellow evil battle? Evil? Evo? Words are hard, man. <laughs> Mmm, it's a boy. What we got? Clear time, race the ghost. Easy. S muffler L level three. Fork. All right, you know what? We're calling it quits on this episode. Two more wins. Noise. One email. Well, we might as well read these real quick. What the hell? What the heck is going to happen? Just left us hanging, boys. L is low rev and H is high rev. Make sure you don't get them confused. Yeah, I drive a van. Better take me seriously, though, or you'll be eating my dust. My van has speed like you wouldn't believe. We're about to race a van, boys? I'm ready. At, la at least in rallies, they tell you which way to go, and you have a co-driver, so that's a load off your back. They kick up a lot of dust, and it's bad for your skin. Ah, it was all the way at the bottom. No. Only people who completely stage four are allowed to race. Yeah. Right? Oh, here it is. Wonder what would happen if you try to bring in an FR. Don't know. Don't freaking know, man. All right, boys. That's it. You know the drill. Subscribe. Come back. I guess we'll keep going until we stop getting racers, right? I mean, I really want to start Midnight Club 3 or redo Tokyo Stream Racer 3 because it's been almost three years. Anyway, boys, you know the drill. Subscribe. Come back. See you on the next one.